Hey everybody, this is Rhino, and we are back to Half Minute Hero. We need to hop into this level quickly because this one's gonna be a doozy. I can, we tried to do it uh, last time and didn't get very far. So I'm just gonna skip all the intro stuff for now. I guess I shouldn't have done that. You start off in such a way here. We'll just try and we'll go through the intro once here. You start off in such a way that you have to basically run to a dragon and get the dragon's ability to fly. That's the only thing I can think, unless maybe I need to slow myself down. Oh, I said I was going to show all that. No, I didn't show that. Let's try that. Let's go back to the quest line. Let's... I thought I knew what equipment I would want. But instead of going the way I was going to go, I'm going to go with the just heaviest build possible you can make. So this is 30 armor. So I'm heavy armor type stuff. 25 plus 10 for the silver male is probably the heaviest armor I can wear. The wig is 25 defense, and I think even when you're looking at the most heavy thing, the charisma wig is still probably the best thing. It, it, oddly enough, this weapon does 24. This weapon does 25 but loses 50 accuracy or 50% chance of critical. So I still think the X stock is probably the best. But let's go with the Wild Saber because it has more criticals. All these other ones are no good. Saber, and then the Bigfoot has slightly more speed and two armor. So we'll do that. If we can't really get this done, I may have to go play the other path, which would kind of suck because we're trying to play the bad path. So it goes pew, he was too much trouble, but now I, all who opposed me have been wiped out. Now I can cast the spell of destruction in peace. Hmm. Another evil lord has appeared. The, the spell of destruction is being cast from all the way up north. Wow, it's far this time around. Take a look, Rido. The castle is completely enclosed. Hmm. Now what are we supposed to do? Maybe if you can find a way to fly, you'll be able to get this castle. Let's think of a way to get to that evil lord's castle for now. Alright, let's go. So, first fight. I take him out. Interesting. Let's go up here. up the leaves from the tree. Yeah. Oops, I shouldn't have skipped that. Anyways, that dragon was saying you need the leaves for, from the tree. Pray, talk to this guy, buy this some barbecue. Play again, very well, let's go. Villages along the way here and here. It's best to visit there. Also, my brethren have been captured by the evil lord. Please help them before you fight people. I got kind of 
run. Something really weird is about to happen. We hit Z the walk right, which is this button. We'll enter this cave. The one guarding the dual greaves is in this place. Hmm, dragon. I will be the one to test and see if you're worthy enough to use a cursed item. Yeah, hurry. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I am not worthy. So we'll rewind time, we'll eat some food, and we're gonna have to grind. So even though we're flying, there's still some stuff here. It's a dragon, now you can get to the North Village by air. So Royal Guard is, I think, a slightly better shield. So we'll take that. go to this village, we're stronger than evil. I hear voices that sound human around the lake. Herbs, get your herbs here. Alright. So some demons flying around. Let's get some fights in here. And up. One more fight. Gotta be careful to actually make it to the right places uh, because you could very easily miss your mark and not land. Who are you? I've been told to defend this post by Lord Hyde. If you want to save the dragons, I'll beat you good. Whoa, you can help. Sidonix and the human guy, thanks. There's one of us still being held. Right. Going here. A dragon? It's not possible. I heard that Lord Hyde defeated you. Oh, screw this. Bring it on. Who is it? Are you Sidonics? Thank you so much, Sidonics. Thanks to you, too. Sildonix, I'm the last one they captured. By the way, I heard from this, this from the monsters. I don't know if it'll be useful. The cursed pair of shoes are somewhere hidden in this land. I'll be leaving now. I wish you luck. So, as far as it seems, there's nothing else in this area. It certainly doesn't seem like there's anything else in this flying around there. And you can't go any further than where the game really wants to go. Try to grind up here just a little bit to get these cursed boots. Shellfish. And hopefully, I'll be strong enough to get through this. Now, I'm the one guarding the dual greaves in this place. Greaves? I thought greaves were things you put on your wrists, not boots. Well done. Looks like you're worthy enough for the dual greaves, but beware, once you equip them, that is it. You'll be unable to flee in your battles. Interesting. Fine. Not that I need to flee. Gonna do any more fights. We're going here. Okay. We got this. We already bought that. I think there's no real reason to grind. Doesn't seem like there's anything up here. Almost to level 50. I would have thought level 50 would have been the max. But it 
does seem like you can just keep on going. If there is any real light level cap, it's probably real far away. I hear voices that sound human around the lake. That's supposed to mean something, I don't know what it means. But let's go ahead and skip to the end here and beat this level. How do I land? Oops. Oh, aren't you the dragon I smacked around earlier? Are you sure you want to do this? I've captured your buddies, so you don't care about them, I see. I have already saved my brethren. Your dirty tricks end right here. Prepare yourself. I see either way. It's all the same to me. Very well, fight me. Let's try to speed this up a little bit. Even so, the sky is fine. Quest cleared. Was there more I could have done? That's the question. So Donix, hey human. You're impressive. I didn't think you could defeat that evil lord. But my brother and he are now self. Safe. Here's a gift for you. Let me help you on your journey. I got the ice shield. That feels like too good of a ending. Good job, Ryder. What was his name? Sildonix? How can you be such a gentleman? He's a dragon too. Now we can chase after Noir from the sky. Let's go, Rido. Only a little more until we get to Noir. Hmm. It does kind of feel like level 25 might be the end. That's what I was thinking. So we got the curse shoes and the grinder, and there was no split path, and so there's no reason to do this level again unless we're trying to get a faster speed, which we could probably do easier later. Almost certainly, because once we start going back and doing some of the split paths we haven't done, we'll get more items, and then those items will be useful. A castle that's completely surrounded. In order to get there, Rido seeks a dragon. He healed the dragon Sildonix. Riding atop the dragon, Rido saved the world. Next time on Hero 30, farewell, Bandit Trio. So, no split path there. You had to get that dragon to win. Great, keep it up, she says. The curse shoes are hidden somewhere. It's like a dream to ride on a dragon. I want to get on later. I never saw the... I saw the bandit trio ahead. Please be careful. Hmm. I kind of feel like you have to do the bandit trio thing, too. But see, what's weird is we could have skipped here. So I'm wondering if maybe by skipping here you would, the next path would be downward and everything is going to meet kind of in the middle. It can't be too far away. We've kind of seen everything. Oh well, let's do uh, Farewell Bandit trio now, We've, since that didn't take us that long. Interesting turn of events we've done as far as choosing heavier equipment instead of speed. You would think you would just want speed, but I guess you don't. So the ice shield gives us 25 and 25 shield and 1 armor. This gives us 3 armor and 35 for the royal guard. I think we want the Royal Guard if we're gonna stick with our thought. The Silver Mail is still the best bet. The Charisma Wig is still the best bet. I guess the White Saber is still the best bet. And so we have the Dual Greaves now. They give us 35 speed, 5 attack, 5 armor for 10. I think they're worth it. It's not really worth it to flee. Anyways, I almost never do it. So, Silver Lover and Fake Killer. That's the one thing that I think I want to do though, is I want to take the Silver Spear and 
see if this works. Let's see if we end up fighting a bunch of demons and the silver spear helps me out a lot. Episode 828, Farewell Bandit Trio. Woohoo! Power, overwhelming power. Awesome, I'm awesomely awesome. I'm on the top of the world. Oh wait, I guess I'm supposed to cast that spell. Hello, Rido. Here's yet another stupid evil lord that's casting that spell. Now that we have a dragon, it'll be easy peasy lemon squeezy. Now then, the evil lord's castle is here. It'll be quick trip on the dragon. See you later. Wow, so... Yes, it is. Uh, this is no good. I need that. We need to make a mad dash to this area. Pray? Let's talk to this guy. This is bad, this is bad. Larry has gone mad. Calm down, Cully. Some strange wizard called Nor came to us the other day. He was obviously suspicious, but for some reason Larry really started to like him. They were doing something, and before I knew it, Larry started acting strange. He left and shut himself into the castle up north. You don't know what Larry is capable of. Please stop Larry for us. Without Larry, I, I, I have a bad feeling about this. We can't cross the ocean to the castle where Larry is. I know a lot happened between us, but th that's all in the past. Let's let bygones be bygones. Would you please try and help Larry get us in to be back? So we have this new Stop Larry thing. Welcome, I'll take some outside. There's something strong turbulence around the evil's castle. This is not working well. This is not working well at all. Yeah, I don't see... I don't see how I could... Like, if I rush... That way... I can't even get to the castle. Tick tock, tick tock. Hey, it's been 30 seconds. What kind of power am I gonna get? Go. So, silver lover obviously can't mean use the silver spear. That thing is just far too weak. We'll go ahead and set this. Then hop back in. So we're noticing a big difference there. Does this city have a time rewind? The wind is caused by a monster on the island north of the castle. Depending on, depends on the time, but some shallow spots are actually holes. Interesting. Shallow spots are actually holes. Level up. One time. Let's talk to Cully. Same co conversation either way. Buy some food. North of the castle, sir. Run, run, run. 
Oops. Screwed that up. Try it again. Let's get these levels up as we're uh, flying around. At certain time, this turns into a hole. Go through this hole. Come out here. And then we gotta run. This is not good. I need something. We gotta take out that monster first before we deal with the whole So the question is, how would you do this level without the dragon? Because I really feel like you might actually What is it? You can't get here, get to the island from here. Iron boots. Go and buy the iron boots. Let's go ahead and wanna get in this hole. It's so tiring to keep up the winds for 30 seconds straight. Huh? You're not the guy Nora was talking about. I was just getting tired. I'll eat you whole and then quit this stupid job. Gotta hurry up and kill this guy. Go, now I can finally rest. So quickly rewind. Skip all this. Buy some food. Treasure of the Mimic, Treasure of the Mimic, we got a new thing. Let's roll back this way. Go back in here and pray. Get some more of this. I think we're safe. We're probably already stronger than the hole is waterlogged. Depends on time, but some shell spots are actually holes. The wind cause is caused by the monster. I'll take out a snake. So that hole. Which one of these holes did we? Do? To this one, and that goes there. Okay. And this one, I think, gets us to the island, right? Yeah, that just gets us here. can't get to the island from here. Let's 
so I think we've done everything. If there's something new or different, I'm definitely not seeing it. Seems like we've done all that can be done. Let's go ahead and pray. Buy some food. And let's go take on Larry. Oh, I was wondering who it was. The power is overflowing. And coupled with that spell that Noah taught me, I can get even more powerful. I will get even more power in my hands. What? I'm being tricked? Shut your power. Oh, you've got it in my way. So you've got in my way so many times before. But I'll show you. Here's my duplication spell. Blarg, Blarg, you defeated me yet again. How many times is it now? Quest cleared. Hopefully that was what I was supposed to do. Larry, hey Rhino. I heard from Moe and Curly, you helped me big time. Of all people, I didn't think you would be the one to save me. Looks like I ain't all that. I'll go into hiding for now, and um... Thanks. I got the light armor. Oh, look at him get so quiet. But he still thanks you, so I think he's not actually a bad guy. But that Noir, he's unforgivable. How could he teach a child the spell of destruction? That Noir is starting to get him more ruthless in his methods. The last battle draws close. Right up. Start acting like it, right up. This game has a weird thing where it just makes some strange noises every now and then. Like, sounds like the game might be uh, messing up or something. Let's see. The only thing I think I could do here is the fake killer, which probably means uh, requires me to run and kill multiple multiples of his uh, mirror images which is something I think I could do off screen or I don't know it's, it yeah I think I probably would want to do it off screen because it's just gonna be a lot of work to get back to that point to kill a bunch of fake fakes and make sure I don't have the cursed boots so I can't flee because I'll have to flee to make sure he summons more fakes and I don't kill the original. Larry has turned into an evil lord of through Noir. Mo and Curly asked Rido for help. They weren't really bad, so Rido obliged. After his defeat, Larry was free from the spell. Noir draws closer, little by little. little. Who can stop Noir? Next time on Hero 30, Infinite Weapon Lord. Good work, let's keep this up. There was a wonderful hel helmet somewhere here. I already found that. The bandit trio isn't as bad as they seem. There's an evil lord that is a weapon collector up ahead. Be careful. I'm kind of a weapon collector. So, you're gonna have to, um, on 29, you're going to have to go to Infinite Weapon Lord. There's no split here. And so, how much time do we have? No time! Let's go ahead and look at our equipment. With the new light armor, we have plus 25 for 5, which I think is the same as silver armor, but half the weight. And it is also probably the best thing we could have right now, it seems. The silver sirret is plus two, plus three armor. Which, honestly, I still feel like that charisma wig is way better. The iron boots are plus five, plus twenty-seven, plus four armor. Uh, 
honestly, this is the dual greaves are still probably the best you could do. So I'll just put those on. And then the Royal Guard is still probably the best you can do. It seems like weight doesn't really matter. We did get the Silver Lover uh, title, which was to get the Silver Helmet. Okay. That's good to know. So we're set. I don't know how this is going to play out. We may end up just doing Quest 29 and then seeing if that goes to Quest 30, which is the final battle. Or if it looks like Quest 30 is still going to be uh, something else. It's very strange that this setup can also split here. Because that means there's two levels going downward, I would bet. And somewhere in the middle here, maybe very close to the beginning, uh, first dot, everything feels like it's going to end. Anywho, that's going to be it for this recording. As always, I ask you to like, share, subscribe, comment if you want to, and watch every second of my videos. All that helps out. If you want to support me, you can click on my name, Rido. On the right will be a blue button that says support this channel. Click it, make a donation. And if you want to friend or follow me on basically any social media sites, there's a whole bunch of links down below. Thank you for watching. Have a good evening.